<laughs> My goodness, you guys. So, I need to know who watches. I speak about wrestling and I speak about makeup and all kinds of things. But both mostly makeup and well mostly wrestling and makeup and I need to know for reals who watches because straight up just because your purse <laughs> be honest I need to know honesty right now this has nothing to do with taking shit off you do? I don't need to know those things. I just need to know. Yes, I watch you just because I'm a straight up perv. You watch because you're bored. Okay, not because you're a perv. Just because you're bored. I have no makeup on. A lot of times when I come on, I am fully done up. And if you guys watch me, you do. Okay, so we have Mikey and CG.136. Both of you do. <laughs> Yo, you are a perv. Okay, well, we have two people who've admitted it. And that's it. Okay. So, I don't know if you guys have... Well, that's the whole point. Do you watch me? That's the thing. Do you watch this show when I'm talking about wrestling just because you're a perv and you want to watch me just because I'm pretty? Or do you want to hear what I have to say? That's what I'm asking. So, okay. So, I've had a couple of you admit it, right? So. Am I a WWE diva? No, I am not. So, I decided that you guys are, for those of you who do watch me that are pervs, but you are respectable and you are when I say respectable you treat me with respect when you watch me um, just so you know I know the ones because if you weren't respecting me even though you're a perv and you watch me I would know Okay, um, so anyway, I wanted to do something for you pervs, okay? And we're going to have a little bit of a war. And, well, I don't care if you find me attractive or not. Anyway, those of you who do perv out... <laughs> And who do only follow me for these reasons and watch for these reasons. Um, we are going to have aloha. Hello and goodbye. Goodbye and hello. I know. Oh, that's about all I know. Aloha and mahalo and I don't know. Anyway. I wanted to do something for you pervs who have been kind to me. Because if you weren't kind to me, I would have blocked you by now. Right? If you watch me, you know that. So, what I have here, something that pervs would like. Right? Is this something that pervs would like? Okay? Is it? Or not? 
Is this something that pervs would like? Yes, it is, right? And it's mine. Yeah, it is. So, I'm thinking if one of your pervs want this, I will give it to you. If you want me to sign my name in it, I will do that to you and I'll send it to you. But we got to figure out which perv wants it more and which perv is going to get it. How are we going to do that? Well, originally I thought we can do a super hard off. <laughs> and uh, you guys can just super heart your asses off. And I could go from there. So if you want to do that, we can do that, go for it. If you're a girl, I have several things that are for women who are not pervs that I would like to give to them for being awesome followers. And even men, if you want these things that are from me, you can. You're not buying this, you're winning it, so. It's just a way to figure out who to send it to. <laughs> and stop with the religious talk. This has nothing to do with religion, okay? I am not going to model anything. I'm sorry. Okay, yeah, you have to pay money for super hearts, big deal. If you don't want to give them, then don't. But the thing is, if you want it, I think this is a way we could figure out who wants this. Um, you can talk about Botox and lip fillers, but I don't have any. You want something? Am I okay? I have allergies there that are a mess. What do you mean, did you win yet? You haven't done anything to win. Nobody has. <laughs> so I don't think you guys understand. No, I'm not sick. Allergies are not being sick. Yeah. You're a purr, but that's not why you check in on me. You have a night of code. Well, I'm just saying, I'm willing to send this to somebody. I couldn't eat too fell in that stream. <laughs> if they want to do something for it. And screw the asshole that says, oh, super hearts, you're going to buy it. Well, you know what? Super hearts are also on here considered a form of tipping. And just so you guys know, also, I'm providing you a service by entertaining you when I come on here. So when I entertain you, that's also a way to tip me.
You're doing something now. Okay, whatever. I'm sorry. I don't get naked for people. Mm -mm. That's not what I do. That's not the kind of dancing that my mommy and daddy put me in when I was two years old. And that's not the kind of dancing I did my whole life. And then as a professional, when I turned 15, that's when I became a professional dancer. And then I went to college and I went to college for dance. And then I continued dancing. So that's not what I do. I used to dance. Yeah. But do I like booze? I like alcohol. Yes, I do. But I don't drink anymore. You want to know why? Because when I do, I can't sleep. My career? Well, this one's a hard one, guys. I am unable to work. I'm on disability because I have a disease that started when I was 16, and it's called CIDP. Chronic Inflammatory Demyelinating Polyneuropathy. It's like MS, but worse. And I have this little thing right here. You can see it. You see it? And that's where my medicine goes in every other week for two full days. Yeah, that's my port. It's the portal. And just so you know, if you guys blow, if blah, 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 if you guys donate blood, I thank you. I get IVIG. So if you donate blood, I thank you. It takes 20,000 blood donors to get one dose of medication for me. And that one dose of medication is something I get every other week. So 20,000 blood donors for one dose of medication. And then a week goes by. And then the following week, I get another dose. And it costs about $10,000 every other week. Yeah, can you believe it? Insane, right? Your wife is an at-home infusion nurse, and she gives IVIG. Oh, man. What is my blood type? O positive. They charge my insurance. No, not $10 million, 10000 every other week. What? <laughs> My facial expressions say that I am insecure and a frequent liar. I'm highly secure and I don't lie. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, it doesn't go by that. They use all different kinds of blood types because of how they process it and stuff. They use all different kinds of blood types in order to make the IVIG. But thank you very much. <laughs> Flower pot. Yeah. Let's see here. Oh, wait here. Hold on. Salacious Crumb, are you still here? No, I'm not saying I'm a perv. 
I'm asking if the people who tune in, if the men who tune in when I do this, if you're pervs. Because if you are, <laughs> I am saying if you are, I'm willing to give you a gift. And I'm just saying, trying to find a way to yeah. how to do this. Hello, Chris. How are you? Oh, you know, life and everything. Just trying to trying to make some perverts day and apparently they don't want their day to be made. <laughs> yeah, me too. I love this tank. Paige is beautiful. <laughs> uh, to each their own, but in my opinion, I think that person has their wires crossed. That's silent on your end. Uh oh. Hold on. Uh oh, Chris, I can't hear you. Uh oh, Chris, hello. I can't hear him either. I can't hear him either. So, well, apparently, apparently. Yeah, Periscope's been giving lots of people problems lately. So. Don't know. Don't know what the deal is. So. You like him on the heels? <laughs> it's okay. No big deal. People be crazy. That's. Not a big deal though. Ooh, let's calm this rat's nest out because it's been up in crazy ponytails all day. What am I up to today? Well, I did a lot today. Um, I got up and fed my dogs, did some laundry, I cleaned my bathroom. Started in cleaning my closet, and then oh, just did all, I've done a lot of little things that add up to a ton of big things. Do you know what I mean? And uh, yeah, just shit like that. Uh, I can't seem to get one book written without having all of these brain surges of ideas for other books. Hold on. Okay. Hello, you were on with Turnbuckle Chick. How are you? Yes, hello, you're on with Turnbuckle Chick. How are you? Okay, you got to keep it up. Keep up the pace. You got to speak English. Keep up the pace. And I need to know who who you are, what your name is, what's going on. Don't call me baby. My name is Turnbuckle Chick. Okay, you just fucked up. Bye. Sorry. Well, you know, I have this rule. If I'm going to 
allow people on to talk to me, they can't slow this down. You have to be able to speak English, not English as a fourth language English. You need to be able to speak English. You need to be able to know what's going on in the conversation, keep up with the conversation, and treat me correctly. Don't call me baby. I'm not your baby. I'm my boyfriend's baby, and that's it. Nobody else's. Sorry. Okay. You heard what I had to say. I will let you speak. But you've heard what I had to say. So let's try this again. See, it's loading. Hello, you were gonna, you were on with Turnbuckle Chick. How much? How are you? What's your name? What is your name? Okay, your name's Kevin. Okay, nice to meet you, Kevin. So what did you want to say? Well, this is, so guys, they can't hear you for some reason. And let me just say this. Basically, everybody, what Kevin is saying is that um, he's, he's saying that he runs into a lot that, um, like, he can't have conversations with women on here because women women have run into uh, men just treating them like crap and saying, uh, treating them how you guys treat me a lot is open, baby open, or show tits, show boobs, uh, show pussy uh, sex, at, and they'll ask for sex, or you want sex, or fuck, and they spell fuck wrong, or things like that. And then because of that, he can no longer have conversations. Um, and he's talking to me about that and how I'm dealing with it. Well, and why I put that title on? Well, I put the title on because I do have, hello, you're on. I do have, um, okay, so anyway, that the answer is like, um, I put the title on because I have followers. I come on here. I do have people that follow me that always are here. Um, and that do that to me. And I just kind of ignore them or I tell them off. Um, but the reason I did it is I do have those core people um, who are pervs. I know they're pervs, but they actually treat me well. Hold on just a second. And the whole point was that I wanted to reward those pervs that treat me well. And um, 
I was going to give you guys this, this bra of mine that is mine. And the whole point was you purrs had to fight it out with super hearts. And whoever gave me the most super hearts could then have it. Hello, what's your name? Enric? Enric, where are you from? My name is Turnbuckle Chick. Where are you from? Armenia? Oh, okay. I know where that is. So do you enjoy it there? Is it hot there? No? <laughs> no, you don't enjoy it there? No, it's not hot there. Well, I'm going to have to let you go because people can't hear. They can't hear you talking. Um, there's just an issue going on. I don't know what it is. It's not you. It's Periscope right now. So um, please don't leave. But I'm going to have to let you go. But thank you for stopping by, okay? Thank you. I'm sorry. Can I tell you something? Tell me whatever you want. <laughs> what is BC? What do you mean BC? Like British Columbia or BC is in the time before Christ or before the common era? They're both mean the same thing in the timeline. Because not everybody's Christian, so historians had to change life, change history, and say, ah, before the common era, and still make it sound like it's B.C. Oh, because. B.C., because. Yes. Slang, or not slang, but just shortening words. Yes, because. Yeah, that's another one. I'm making things too complicated here. Okay. Well. Of course pervs can watch me. I don't care if pervs watch me at all. I know they watch me. I'm just trying to reward them for not treating, for the ones I know who are pervs, for not treating me horribly. And give them this. But none of them want to fight for it. So I will keep it and keep wearing it against my skin on my boobies. And they can just suffer for not even trying to get it. <laughs> That's their problem. Oh, all you peeps. Anyway, I'm going to go now, and I will talk to y'all late, okay? Maybe I'll make up on later.